Frogs, there you go, hippity hop, right into my stomach. Howdy everybody, welcome back to another episode of TRF. Today is gonna be a fun episode because we, together, you and me, we're gonna go through the experience of catching frogs, cleaning frogs, and cooking frogs, and of course, after that, eating frogs. And these are, I don't know exactly what species of bullfrog these are, I just know they're giant. They are huge, I mean, these are like, these are some meaty thick thighs. Some thick, it's a thick boy, or girl, I don't know. I don't wanna misgender frogs nowadays. But before we get into the process of how we clean and cook the frogs, of course you guys are gonna wonder, how did you catch an entire cooler's worth of bullfrogs? Well, that is a great question. And right now we're gonna head to the lake to show you guys how I caught those frogs in a rather unconventional way. I just scared about 17 frogs off that grass. A bullfrog. Catch him. Catch him. That's always good content. I need a good thumbnail. I want to catch a frog on a frog. I got, oh, uh -oh. he's looking at it. Uh -oh. Come on, buddy. Oh. 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 Didn't know if he had it or not. I just set that up. One. Giant guys. I got one folks. <laughs> <Giant>. <laughs> we having dinner tonight. We eating good. Ooh, look at Ooh, that. Baby. Oh baby. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> what? Look at that. Oh my goodness. That thing is huge. That's how those bass right wow. there are gonna get so big. Weigh that thing. I'm gonna this is the biggest frog I've ever held in my hand. <laughs> Dude, I, I've never had frog legs, but I can imagine that that would taste good wow. right there. Wow. I cannot believe that it ate that. Put them in the lab. I'm lane. putting, dude, I'll put them in here for now. That was fun. Here. There you go. Yes, sir. <laughs> no, <laughs> he got off. <laughs> got him. Got him. They won. No they, yep. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Bring it in here, you frog. Yes, not a big one actually. A nice one though. You got him in the arm. I got him in the arm. Ooh, he's strong. He's got some core muscles. He's been hitting the gym. Going live well. Oh, <laughs> <that's> too hard. <laughs> I think I see a few more up here. Oh, they're there. Oh, I see him, yeah. We are out here on one of the best <laughs> fishing lakes in the central Texas. <laughs> And we're catching yeah, frogs. We're catch frogs. <laughs> of course. The bass are not biting, so we must go for their. Oh. Uh 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 oh. Tyler is the <laughs> frog catching machine. Ladies and gentlemen, Tyler started a new YouTube channel. Yes, sir. Frogging for frogs. <laughs> the bullfrog. The bullfrog channel. <laughs> ah, you are strong, Mr. Bull. No bull about it, you know what I mean? I've caught three. This video is gonna get a few dislikes, and that's okay. You hurt the frogs. Oh, really? Wah. Not only did I hurt them, I ate them. You cooked them. <laughs> Number four. That is unreal. This is fun. Folks, subscribe if you like this uh, change of pace. No, it doesn't. Oh, you get him. Just, just winch yeah, him in. Winch him in. First frog, baby. <laughs> first frog. Oh, get him in the boat. Yeah. Get him in the boat. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. I earned and perfected the frog. <laughs> That's unbelievable. Oh my goodness. Give me, give me some of that. <laughs> Boom. Get back there. Let me get you. Let me get you. David got his first frog. Heck Who's yeah. Who's taking that thing off? Oh, you're not gonna touch it? No. Oh, come on. No, come on, Tyler. Oh, I'll it's get him off for you. you. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> All up to me, he says. Oh, All right, there he goes. Now it is number five. Oh man, I'm gonna have a good dinner today. Oh, there's a big one right there. I'm gonna hang it over the tree limb. David, look at this. I'm hanging over the tree. Oh, oh no! no! <laughs> <Today>. <laughs> yes! Let's go! That oh my goodness. Catch of the day right uh -huh. there. 
Tyler, tell us how you just cut that. So I did the old the old Bama bass where I hung it over the tree and kind of shook yeah. it there. And Mr. Bull came. How many is that? This is a seven or six. <laughs> I don't know. Give me over a... that tree in there. All right, this camera's going on. Two for two, baby. Are you going two? I got a bass. Look. Oh, he's got a bass. Oh, we came off. Looky here. That's a big one. Look where you got him and look where I got him. See, that's, that's how you hook set a, full, a bullfrog. That's right the I, ideal hook set. You see that? Oh, man. Hey, there's another one. Ah. Right there, one Tyler's going to catch him. Oh, man. Look at that, huh? That is some late summer, early fall bullfrogging right there. Uh huh. That's it. That is it. Look at that thing. Look at that juiciness. Woo! <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> You know, these bullfrogs today, they're really keying in on that uh, frog presentation. That's bro. It's all about the frog. There's another one. I got another one. No. Oh, three for three, baby. Three for three. Oh, I'm catching you, boys. I got this one by the leg. Oh. Look. No, you don't. He's in the mouth. Yes. <laughs> guys, that is, that's three casts, three frogs. This is unreal. Hey, comment below if you guys want to see me come back and actually gig them from the bank. Although catching them from the catching them from the boat is pretty fun too. Oh no, we're not crazy. But now we're kind of into it. Uh huh. Because really, what I, you know, finding them, you got to really search down those. You re you really do, and you can't just yank on them. You know, it takes a certain kind of hook set, a little bit of finesse. I'll tell you what, though, I've learned it. Good. Yeah! Oh my goodness! No way! I'm on fire! I am on fire! Are you kidding me? I'm trying to catch a bass. I've caught enough frogs. Oh, he came off. No! No! You're staying in the boat. Got him! We've got to be up to 10 now. Oh, this is sick. Now that you guys have seen all the footage of how I caught the frog, did some frog juice land on the lens? I think it did. Oh no. Oh uh, yes, yeah, some frog juice landed on the lens. That is delicious. So basically what we're gonna do here is we're gonna cut right behind the head, like so. And we're gonna get these handy dandy pliers right here. Get under the skin and we're just gonna pull it off. And then we have our legs and mm. then right behind the body right here, let me get these scissors real quick. We're gonna cut right, there's two bones you're gonna have to cut through. If I can muscle my way through them. These scissors are not no. excellent for this. And now we have frog legs. I guess I forgot to include um, uh, graphic content ahead. So if you were triggered already, I, I apologize. But uh, we're gonna do a little time lapse here of the rest of the frogs and we'll see you guys. See you in a second for the preparation and cooking phase. the cover well okay one sec folks I'm gonna put you all down for a second Yo. all right had to get the cover off the Traeger this here is a Traeger grill slash smoker slash oven I do work with Traeger they are a, a sponsor here on the channel and to make these frog legs I'm going to warm up the Traeger uh, first I got to turn it on the cool thing about these grills is that they're basically like uh, <laughs> Some people call them an easy bake oven in a bad way. I call them an easy bake oven in a good way because it's an easy bake oven. You press the button to turn it on. You turn up the temperature. We're gonna go to 225 and we're gonna press ignite. And just like that, them pellets are going to work. So now that we have the grill preheating for these frog legs, we have been marinating uh, all the frog legs. It's gotta be at least like three to four pounds. Like we have a lot, as you guys saw from the video, giant, giant frog legs. And so we have this marinating in Italian dressing. Now the reasoning for that is because Italian dressing has uh, oils and spices, but not too much of either one of those. So it's kind of a good pre-marinade. We didn't want to mess up uh, the first time we ever made frog legs and marinate it you know, for 24 hours and something we didn't like. So we just did it for a few hours in the fridge. And now we're gonna do some dry rub. And the way that we're approaching this is that 
these are basically chicken wings. You know, they're, they're frog legs, it's a different type of meat, but Ryan and I can't really see how it would be that much different than making chicken wings. So, so we looked up on the Traeger website, they have tons of articles there on how to smoke chicken wings, and we're basically applying that same exact recipe to the frog. So whatever we end up doing, I'll have it put in the, in the uh, video description down below, that way you guys can make some frog legs for yourself. But we got a few minutes before the grill fires up. Now that's a lot of meat. We marinated them, as I said, in Italian dressing, and now we're gonna put some salt, pepper, and some blackening rub on them. Do we know what we're doing with frog legs? Not exactly, but we know what we're doing with meat in general. And this doesn't look that different. Looks like a chicken wing. Look at that. Look at that. Well done, Ryan. A nice even spreading of blackening. It is set to 212. It's going down right now. 225 at super smoke. So we're gonna leave those on there for 45 minutes or until the internal temperature reaches. We're gonna go with what chicken is, 165 degrees. Of course, I'll do some more research in the next 45 minutes, but so we'll see you guys at the end, and I am pumped. The grill is rocking and rolling at 400. We are going to put the frog legs on there for like one, I don't know, two, two and a half minutes on each side, and they should be done. That looking juicy, juicy. We have taken the frogs off. One sec. Power off, come on. And they look delicious. It's time to eat. We're eating good. Moment of truth, boys and girls. Will the frog, look at that, it's falling off the bone. That's good. That is good stuff, Ryan. Mmm. Mighty fine, mighty fine. Mm -hmm. Well, folks, thanks for watching this episode of, uh, of Tyler's Rule Fishing. Hey, if you found this channel because of a frog video, yeah, you guys might as well stay for some bass fishing tips. I love uh, taking you guys on my adventures with me across the country catching bass and, of course, other fish as well. But, of course, I had an awesome opportunity to catch some bullfrogs that were giant. And I said I'm not going to pass this up, especially when I have a smoker like a Traeger and uh, have a good lunch. So, with that said, we'll see you guys in the next episode of TRF. Mmm. Let's go.